Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 2 of our Yangus Khan run. Sorry, I forgot what we were doing here for a moment. I think it was carpet sieging everything ever. Because, you know, I like occupying entire countries. It's great. Oh! You must be new here. You really shouldn't ask for more suitable accommodations. Uh... Well, I'm a hunter, and I'm cruel, so yeah. Oil up the rack, baby! <laughs> so if you three guys want to stay there, I'm okay with that. Like, just never leave these lands, though, because they're mine. If you do, I will have to see crush you. Mm -hmm. Suitable. How about the oubliette? Yay. Oops. Get out of there. Oh no, my daughter-in-law died. Unmarried heir. You already have kids. You already have lots of kids, but you're going by Ultimo, and you kind of suck. Anyways, do we have any Yane lovely ladies? Nope. Alright. Uh, well. No one worth you. You can take a concubine. I'll give you some land. It will be great. No! No land for anyone! No. Only I get the land. Oh, shit. Uh... Fuck. So, I'm probably gonna have to... Sorry about that. Raise tribal army. Uh, how much prestige is that? That's a lot of prestige. And for 2,500 men? Jeez. Kinda underwhelming. I feel like that's more for when we lose everything else we have. Convert to local culture? No. Nope. Sieging. Everything's going well. Good. Good, good, good. Mm -hmm. So, all this is going to be ours in like five years. Then my son's going to take over. Also, real great. Ogadai, Shagatai. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should put a sign over the dungeon walls, you know. If you ask for better accommodations, you will be sent to the Oubliette. Makes sense to me, right? I mean, it might spare my prisoners some pain. Mm, not that it bothers me particularly. They can suffer all they want. I just feel they should know the risks of asking for better accommodations. Whoa, India! Completely wrecked. They're gonna try to attack soon. Unless I grossly missed the mark. I did. Good to know. So these 4,000 dudes, or 2,000 dudes, are apparently like their army at this point. 
Everything else has been sieged and destroyed. Good to know. Let's wipe it. Oh, hey. Here I am. Go to. Great. Another top level holding sieged. Great job, everyone. I'm proud of you. Yeah, this is probably going to be my most uh, stream of conscious y let's play. Because there's really not much to talk about beyond us. Oh, wow. Was, did I have triplets that came of age? Anyways, there's really not that much to talk about beyond the fact that... One second, my brain broke. It's kind of boring, is what I'm saying. We're just watching these dudes siege everything, and that's fun, you know? But... but what's the commentary going to be? Day 217, still sieging everything ever made. But, actually, here's something we can discuss a little bit. A pet peeve of mine. So, if we were going realistic, which, in this game, obviously, that's... That's important. Deceitful or honest? Hmm. Well... I like having good stuff. Diplomacy. Right, here's what I was saying. If we were trying to more accurately simulate the Mongol invasions, we wouldn't be doing this. We'd just go in to a city. If they resisted, we'd kill everyone in the area. And then we'd say to everyone around them, Hey, surrender to us instantly, or we're going to do the same thing to you that we did to them course that would need to bring in all sorts of new mechanics in this game like uh, I don't know some way of tracking your fear an infamy mechanic perhaps and some other stuff I can't remember right now probably very important stuff almost positive oh yeah we'd have to simulate the whole like completely burning of a province I'd say we cut it down to zero base tax wipe out all but the top level holding and then just have it slowly recover with time that could work wouldn't be particularly fun though but it would be way more interesting than watching me siege through every damn top level province in the game which is what we're going to be doing now Okay. Oh wait, no, are you going to fight them? Damn it. Oh well. Suitable, how about the oubliette? Oh wait, no, get out of there. So, we've got most of uh, the northern part of the country occupied. Pretty much everyone's dead, which is great. We've got some mass murder in the insaneth degree. Uh, nope. Don't want to convert to anything that's not Yanism. Sorry, buddy. Yeah. The only true faith is the one that has my name in the title.
Yeah, let's kill these guys too. Bam. Muslims hate him. One weird trick to conquering the entire Middle East. Oh, for those interested, the one weird trick is having tons of event spawn troops. Great. More morale, please. Morale is good. Yeah, I just learned how that shift click thing worked a few... Actually, I remember that worked yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. Do you want to duel some assholes? Sure thing. Have fun. Duel anyone you want to, buddy. Dueling's practically an American tradition. Gee, I wonder which tech I'm gonna take. Probably the one that gives me more retinues, followed by the one that gives me more cavalry. Mm hmm. That's about it. So, let's see. We are sieging at 3% every 12 days. They're doing. 3.9% every 12 days. There you go. Kill these assholes for me. We can't allow them to unsiege some of our land. That would be absolutely preposterous. I mean, we could lose pretty much everything, or if not that, enough? Yeah, we could lose enough. Enough to make me not want to do it. Hmm. Turns out we didn't, might not have need to send these guys over there. Oh well. Yeah. Go, go, diplomacy. It's great for larger w realms realms. No! We don't have enough fiefs for all you assholes. Alright. Great. Something happened. And more great news. We got more guys. More guys or the, are the best. It's true. And you're dead, and you're dead, and you're all dead. Where are you going? Loot? No, you're going to Kerman. Follow them. Okay, event. A Sufi sect of dervishes has arisen under the leadership of a certain Haji Bakhtishwali, a mystic from Khorasan. Striving for unity of being, Bektashis trained the soul through meditation and contemplation of the inner meaning of the Quran. The Bektashi order is warlike and especially popular among Sunni Muslim soldiers. The order has sworn to protect Islam and, no c and to combat infidels and polytheists of all kinds. Meh. Yeah. 
We're Mongols, we don't need anything. All we need are thousands of men. Oh, hey, siege another province, why don't you? Man, if I was this guy, I would be so pissed. Like, we've already won. We're just going for style now. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, no. Some kid of mine contracted smallpox. However will I deal with that? Okay, so where are the attackers? Good, good. What are you doing? Why are you just standing there? Go to? Great. Damn it. Uh, we might have a problem. Yep, this could definitely not be good. Maybe. Oh, great. We we should be wrapping the war up. If not this episode, then definitely by next episode. Actually, it will almost certainly be next episode. Also, maybe I should have had the game unpaused. Hey! Suitable. How about the oubliette? Quiver. Mm -hmm. We're gonna win this, I think. Oh shit, no! Don't lose, Mongols! Just hold on for like. Damn it. Yeah, I know. I actually bopped the microphone again. I really need to stop doing that. Okay, perfect. Army of Kog and Yangus. Here. Let's make these assholes useful. So, what's our prestige at? Something good, right? Ooh, landless sons are really hurting us. We should probably land them, then. diplomatically refuse. No, don't siege there. You don't want to siege there. That's silly. Mm -hmm. Go to. Okay. Yes. Yeah, uh, let's see. There. 5,320. Guess how this ends for you. Spoilers. Not well. And one day, I'll remember not to pause while I'm waiting for stuff to happen.
That day will be very far in coming. Anyways, let's finish up this battle. And then we will send our troops over to kill these guys. Because they had the audacity to siege us. Yeah. Okay. Absolutely unacceptable behavior. No one sieges us but me. Got that? Good. Hmm. Looks like they're having a spot of political instability. I wonder why. I hope they get better. Yay, the assassins are destroyed. That's good, I guess. have these three provinces do. If you have to c try to come back in my land again, I'll have to keep killing you. And I really don't want to do his dirty work for him. But anyways, like I said, this is that's the episode. I will see you all next time. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching.